Hello and welcome. My name is Neil Aus and this is episode 8 of our Let's Play campaign of Factorio. We're playing Angels Mods. Let's have a look at the base overview as it looks now. Last time we built down here, we built some lime production and some clay brick production. Now, this is actually where we need to start using both the lime and the clay brick. So we have the clay bricks here stored. I'm going to take a few of those. 500. Yep. Thank you. And they just get started on fitting up again. So what do we want to do today? Let's start with going into NEI. We want to make greenhouses. Greenhouse. Greenhouse? That one. That's a greenhouse that requires glass. Glass comes from molten glass. Molten glass comes from glass mixture. Glass mixture comes from lime and silicon. There are other options. There's a simpler option. But this is one silicon to one glass. This is two silicon. One silicon to two glass at the price of some lime. And we do have the lime, so we're going to do this one. So this is what I want to do. And this is required into a new a new one of these. So uh, we are going to take a look at these. And they require clay bricks. So these are, if I recall correctly, they are pretty damn slow. And we are going to go up here. This is our lime production coming in from one side. Do I actually have some belts? Do I have what I need? It looks like I have pretty much what I need. Let's get it over here. This one is coming in with some silicon. And the first thing I want these to do is simply just merge together. We are now getting some of these. They are... Why don't we just place them like this? I can do glass mixture. Glass mixture, it produces two every four seconds. So it's not very much. Let's have a look. Once we get the glass mixture, let's uh, try to scale it for something else. I need the glass mixture coming in here. So if I have one of these, they work at induction engine, works at a pace of one. Let's build that one and then try scaling it towards it. This one, speed one, every four seconds, it takes 12 glass mixers. So it takes three per second. So I need to produce three per second. This one produces one per every other second. That's one per two seconds. No, that's half per second. So that's one per second. Two, three, no. There. I need six for one of those. One of these will then produce 120 gla molten glass per second. I could actually just make a better one. Yeah, I'm going to make a better one. It does need a bit more steel. It's going to be one and a half. So I need nine of the other ones. Unfortunately, I can't. Let's see the glass one. This glass, it consumes four, ten per second. And this produces 30 per second. So I just need three of these. One, two, three. I, I know these kind of things. And let's also get some pipes. We do have some pipes. So these guys, we need actually one, two. Let's do some of the last ones. Yeah. There, that is exactly how much we need. And I guess this is going to be slow. So why not just take these guys? Yeah, I want to do it. All right, you up and down. Boom, they are ready. These guys are up. Oh, I shouldn't say that. Like, they're not guys. They are inserters. They are. And we take the red ones. There we go. We now have a lot of this. This one goes in and this is where I want to do it neat. We'll just put the US output and it'll be slightly overscaled. Induction engine goes here. Boom. You are going to do molten glass. Go into these three. One, two, three. Flip, flip, flip. Glass one or glass two. I can't do the other glass yet. 
unfortunately, but that's the way it is. So, how should we do this? There, yeah. This, this is fine. And one, two, three. And we have glass coming out. Neat. <clears throat> the one thing I am wondering about is now I'm putting all of these on the same side. This one's just chugging along. And this one's slightly overscaled. But that's fine. I mean, it's going to be producing. You know what? I know I shouldn't be using these, but I am. One, two, one, two, one, two. And then I'm going to take one of these and make him near inserter so that it will always insert equally on both lanes. At this point, I should consider, what should I consider? I should consider, I want it back on the bus, but I also, yeah, let's get it back on the bus. Couldn't I do this much nicer? Yes, I could. I could actually do that. Let's scrap all of this. Let's do it nicer in this way. See? Like this. Maybe even like this. That would actually be incredibly cool to build it like this. It's very condensed. Here, and... Let's kill all of this. And that one. And the loader going here. Come on, Anabots. Click, 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 click. There we go. These are going to go in again. Wow. That one. Cool. And these are now outbound again. And they're going to back, go back on the bus. Not that I think I need it for anything except just to display. Next question is, where should it be on the bus? I mean, I could make it on something else. I could make it on shared with copper. I could share it here. Yeah, I'll, I'll do that. Let's uh, check over here. Yeah, that's the solder. It's taking the top one, but oh, okay. That's not how we do it. Oh, one thing is mainly important here is the fact that I need a box up here for grabbing stuff. That one. And go. I'm going to get 200. Wow, that's a lot of glass already. And while I'm at it, I might as well just start working on the next part. I don't think it really makes sense for me to build greenhouses somewhere. Although I need a ton of greenhouses, then it's a one-time thing. Where's the greenhouse? Oh, I did not research the greenhouse. Come on, this is the first thing you should tell me when I start. Luckily, it's 20, so it takes no time at all. I'm going to get some stone. Boom. If I recall correctly, they require stone. Yes. Go, 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 go. Like this. And look at this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's 40. Forty of those, that should be a pretty good place to start. And what else? I can make more. One, two, three. That's another twenty. Excellent. And anything else I want? No, not really. Now, oh, this one is going to be a glass marker. That was actually quite easy to make the glass. Like this, that's the glass. And let's get some lights on this as well. It's extremely compact. For some reason that looks better. I think this is the most compact I've built the glass. The fact that it goes straight down there. Neat. Alright, so what we want to build is build the greenhouses. What Another thing we need for the greenhouses is the pumps here. One, two, three, four, I think. And then we need an awful lot of iron pipes at some point. I'm going to find a way. Where do I want to build my 
I could build it here, but I think I'll actually build it here. Because I have another plan for this area. So I'm going to build the greenhouses down there. Hmm. I wish I had some other research. Let's build engine research. Because that will help us get towards some of the things I like. Hint, hint. It's a car. And it also leads towards the next part. And that is a... Right, that's the one. This one. I also need definitely need some lights out here. Let's get some lights. This one. Alright, let's start testing some things here. And working on our greenhouses. Should they start here? Yeah, let's start here. Engine. After the engine, I can make a car. Mm-hmm. You can also get into that, but I'm going to build the nanobots because I think I'll be building a lot of nanobots. So I have an option of baking. This one takes 10 seedlings and makes some water. And then after 60 seconds, it gives us some raw wood. That's very nice. So that means 60 seconds, I get 15. That means I get one fourth per minute. That means I need four of these. With four of these, I get one per second. It seems like an obvious way to build this. And I also need more of this. Thank you. And I probably need more pipes as well because I'm going to need a lot of pipes. I do have some of these. I do have some of those. Yes, please. Also some loaders. I still have those. All right. Let's start building this part of it. There. There. And I definitely also want this, these inserters because there's really no point in not doing it. Oh no, damn it. All right, well, we can still try. We'll kill, kill these for now. And? That's pretty satisfactory as a unit here. That unit, I'll replicate it a number of times. So that's one per second, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes, I can count. Or can I? Eight, nine, 10. So this is 40, and that's exactly how many I want. And I go here, here, here. Sweet. And now we just need the robots to actually build stuff faster. And I probably need to, well, I definitely need to go home because I don't have enough of all of this. Now, at this point, this one will come back with wood. This one needs to put seedlings out. Seedlings are, if I recall correctly, built in one of these. Seed, there we go. So you produce seedlings. Now I have an idea that I want to do something like this. And these are going automatically in here. And then I get, that one feeds it from here. And I also get I don't know, something like this, right? To go into sort of the rest of the network. What if I do it here? One, two, three. That's not enough. Because I know that I need a lot of these. So that could be one, two, three, four. And I definitely need four. There we go. So wood comes in, goes back in here. All right, the first thing I, I noticed is that I actually need more wood as well. Wow, how did that end up at 15? That's peculiar, isn't it? How many do I have? 40. And I got, okay, I am incapable of counting. Oh, I wish I had a car. Okay, nanobot speed is, is that like a really slow one? No, 100. So apparently it just slowed down. 
No, it didn't slow down. I'm just getting really impatient about apparently. Those two, not gonna need it anytime soon. I'm gonna need a lot more greenhouses. And we also need more inserters of various kinds. That one. Let's get Oh, that's long reach. Um automobilism. I'm gonna get it, but I'll do it between sessions. That one, that one. Half of those. I don't think I need more of any th anything else. Got it. Only the only the glass, and I need forty per row. And let's get more. Oh, I just need more iron for sure. It's easy. And we go up here for the lights. Long reach. Can I get oh more long reach? Long build. That's very nice. Boom. Two hundred glass. Let's look at these guys. Uh, one, two, three. That's 30. This is 40. So that means one more row. And unless I can actually build 40, one, two. That one. Good. So now I can build two more rows. Of, oh, and I also need some wood to seed it. I actually need quite a lot of wood to seed it because I needed to convert it into but we want to see that it works oh I apparently forgot that one or actually not continued never mind okay so you can see here I picked up some materials like a lot of belts a lot of everything and that has triggered it to move forward I'm gonna get 40 of these and 40 of those so I don't think this is enough yeah, that's definitely enough there we go it's definitely a long build and then I also have a long mine nice that means I have longer reach now and we are building our greenhouses they will hopefully produce a massive amount one two three I think three is the right number I still have enough of those they are not working oh, I need to go in here go nanobots and I have plenty of nanobots too Right, so all the way up there it's good. All the way down there. Let's build some Not everything is perfect because I don't have enough lights. So what if we have these in here? What would happen? So here they're producing. Great. Now at this point I can actually start pruning some of these things that do not make any sense. And I will instead of taking a small blueprint, I'll take the big one. That was long mine. Not that long line. There we go. Ah, it's, it's a decent speed, a decent pace. There we go. Long mine. What do we need for next? Okay, that's blue circuits. Blue signs. Okay, so a lot of other things. I think that under engines. Okay, let's get back up to some of the things we can. I did. There was something about engines. I'll I'll take automobilism because it's fun. Oh, it's oh shoot! It's not working because I am not producing. Water. Boom. No. No recipe available. I have no idea why this is not. Uh, bobs, 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 bobs. I hope it's not here. It's mining. Is it really disabled? To from the start. Well, pipe distance was overall overridden. Enable, 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 enable pure water, enable, enable vanilla barreling, enable background water boring. Oh, that's boring. Now we just get exposed to something you should not have been exposed to. Um, but we need to make this one. This is that's still not there. Oh, this is horrible. But at least we get an introduction. Consider this an introduction to... There's a lot of settings here. Where was it?
Why, Bob? Why? Cheaper steel. Enable groundwater boring. If enabled, the water pump can bore for water anywhere in the map. Water mining patches will not be force enabled. Correct. That was a massive setback here. But we are back again. Come on, 89%. Voila, there's a recipe to pour for water. Uh, see, it can't be here. It has to be, it actually has to be further up. Like this. It'll look, no, it'll look nicer if it's consistent. There. Water. Boom. How much water is it producing? I don't even know what. Don't know. It's 100 per one second. That's not actually a lot, but I think it's enough for these. Are any of them producing? Yes, some of them are producing. Some are producing. Yes, they are. Cool. And it'll always, for some reason, water just flows to the last point first. And again, we will take a blueprint. It goes all the way up here. And place it next to it. That's two. And then I can do three, four, and however many I like. But this one will start producing more, more wood than it consumes, right? It's still, this is still working. I'm pretty sure, no, not entirely, that this one is able to feed everything. Not sure though. Automobilism, we got that one. Can I also just use, what about getting electric engines? Oh, I can't do that until I have a monstrous amount of other things. I'll just start working on these things. Electrolysis, I think it's electrolysis two. And this is the part with angels mods and Bob's mods in general. Sometimes you're like, all right, I need to walk my way through five different researches just to get to the stuff I need. Oh, that was a mistake, I think. There we go. And I have no idea where that one's leading. Uh, let's see. That one, chemical plant. That's the one we were looking for. Why do we have one of these, one of those? That mean, indicates to me that I must have tried to create one of those myself. There, that works. That's all of it, yes. All of it, all of it, all of it, all of it. And you can see here now the it's coming in, excellent. I'll pick all of this up and put it in that one. And now the idea here is like this. And then we will build a balancer here. Oh, was that not even placed? That was, that's strange. And this may seem totally excessive, but I need a lot of this. I need so much. Except the one thing we're missing here is the fact that I can't afford to have everything go out. So once this one gets stuck, yes, finally. And now I can put it in here. You're starting to place things and chemical plant, where are we needing now? That one. Oil processing maybe? I have no idea where I'm heading, but I wanted the engine. It's this one I'm heading towards. Okay, that's a long way to get there. Chemical processing too. Are these working? Yes, they are. And that means for me, it's time to put in another one. Boom. Should be possible. And this is where I will definitely need. I'll, at this point, I'll, I'll definitely need some wires to make sure this one doesn't activate until there is at least 100 or something like that in uh, this one. Get that in here. Chemical processing. I have no idea where that leads. Again, engine. 
Silicon. Why would I need silicon for this? That makes no sense. And you can see here already now, they are starting to accumulate. That's very nice. And I'll place the last 30 of these that I definitely need to place. And let's see where we run out of things first. What do we guess? It looks like we have everything here. Lights, definitely lights. Too bad. Not, a, not gonna fill everything up with lights. That's the least important one though. Now silicon processing. And again, I'm gonna do engine. If I can spell engine here, I have no idea. Then it gets the oil processing. It really has to do plastic to do to an electric engine. Hmm. What? I only have four left. Why am I? Okay, so it was just in queued already. And now, now we can start making plastic. Was it plastic? Maybe. Seedlings. And we need to go back here so we can get all three of them started at a good pace here. Look at this. Look how much it's actually producing now. So I'm going to build definitely one more. Don't think I need more than four at this point. Because they also do... A, oh, look at this. The crisis has uh, has set in. I completely forgot. How much do these take? That's the part. Okay, they take 100 kilowatts. All right. Well, that means the next research is actually going to be something else. I saw engine. Steam engine Mark II. And especially the boiler Mark II is more efficient. So that should be working. I was about to say they'll uh, they'll stop producing once they fill up, but I'm not gonna wait for these to fill up before it stops producing. So I'm uh, I'm gonna hold these for now. I don't technically need these operating, so I'd like them to uh, to idle as soon as possible, and then I'll fill these up later on. But then now the next point is definitely getting the power. However, that's a that's just sort of base maintenance that is not part of our tutorial series so we will but there's something that to be really aware of is that once you start building this for scale you will start using a lot of materials and that means here i'll be make, making some different types of fuel blocks here that i'll bring over here to something that's going to be bigger on the on this one so but this also needs to be scaled up to mark two all right, so that was our production. We produced some glass and we are, have already started using glass to produce a lot of, now it went away, a lot of greenhouses. And that is how we produce wood. So that was a quite comprehensive episode that solved uh, two things in order to move forward. And by just piping this wood directly back into the base, we now have a fully self-sufficient base that does not need any inputs. However, it is now running short on power and that we need to solve before we can scale up into trains where we do the expansion so with that thank you very much for joining hope that you join me next time as we continue to do another tutorial session on the next part of the progression in the angel space thank you very much see you next time bye